see the curtains hanging in the window in the evening on a Friday night. Little light is shining through the window, lets me know everything's alright. Summer breeze makes me feel fine, blowing through the jasmine in my mind. Today is Friday, February 21st, 2003, day two of the cycle. Your thought for the day? Books are the quietest and most constant friends and the most patient of teachers. I'm Chris Price. And I'm Kelly Allman. Now would you please stand, face the flag for your Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. A reminder to all interested junior high wrestlers, practice for PJW Wrestling is Tuesday and Thursday until 4 p.m. Any questions, see Coach Gresh. If you are playing a spring sport, you must sign up with the nurse by today to get your physical. No telephone permissions are accepted. No form equals no physical. There will only be one activity bus this week. Girls interested in playing softball should sign up in the office and pick up the softball packet. The pit band for Annie Get Your Gun will practice today until 4 p.m. in the band room. The next ski club trip to Seven Springs will be Sunday, February 23rd. We will be, we will be leaving at 2.35 from the auditorium entrance and returning that evening at, at 10.45. Tell your ride to be here by 10.30. You must sign up and pay in the following homerooms by the end of homeroom time on Friday, February 21st. 7th graders see Mr. Dunn in room 121. 8th graders see Ms. Plyler in room 128. 9th and 10th graders see Mr. Mangus in room 210. And 11th and 12th graders see Ms. Miklas in room 305. Be late to order a yearbook. RAS will be accepting orders through the month of February. Additional forms are available in room 147. Don't miss this opportunity to have lasting memories for the 2002-2003 school year. Attention Women's Chorus. Today's class will be a study hall. Passes will not be issued during class today. Please bring study hall materials. You will not be permitted to leave the classroom unless you come with a pass. The library is closed, period HI today. The last day for the book fair will be Monday. Attention all you Harry Potter fans. See Mrs. Allman if you're interested in receiving the Order of the Phoenix delivered to your home the week of June 22nd, only $29.99. In addition to the book, you'll receive a hat and certificate here at school. Deadline for payment is February 28th. The Funorama will be today from 7 to 9 p.m. The cost will be $1 and is only for students grades 7 and 8 from United. During the Funorama, for $1, you can participate in a volleyball game or foul shooting contest. Students whom owe extended after-school detention are not permitted to attend. Please make sure your parents are here to pick you up at 9 p.m. A representative from PA Free Enterprise will be visiting United on Monday, February 24th. Any junior or sophomore who does not have social studies this semester and is interested in attending the presentation should obtain a pass from Miss Michaelis in room 305. Passes will be written for period F only. Girls 9 through 12th grade will start March 3rd. All players must be present for the first practice and have their physical and signed permission slip with them to, for, to the first practice. Anyone 13 to 15 years old interested in playing Junior Legion Baseball may sign up this Saturday morning in the Auxiliary Gym from 9 to 11 a.m. Bring your glove for a light workout. As a result of numerous winning stickers not being redeemed during the recent vending promotion, there will be a drawing for the remaining free lift passes for Seven Springs Ski Resort. Please write your name on the specially marked Coca-Cola paper located in the high school office. Drop the completed form in the box labeled Coca-Cola 
Limit one entry per person. The drawing will take place today. Winners will be announced today as well as being posted in the high school office. This week's U-turning word is Calipash. Calipash is a scientific term for an orange. That it means it's an exotic tango dance. That sounds like some Middle Eastern city somewhere. <laughs> Chinese pop tart. Buffalo food. Well, after those interesting answers, the correct definition is the dull green upper shell of a turtle. Hey Carmen, you ready for the quiz bowl match this Wednesday? Yeah, my team is going to do great. You're not going to beat us. We're going to qualify for county. Yeah, we'll try this. What's the capital of Venezuela? What's the square root of 27? How many presidents were born in February? Thanks for watching the show this week, and we'll see you next time. Jazz.